Maybe you need... God, I'm bored. Kid, how do I look? Uh, great. <laughs> Who's the lucky guy? Dr. Watt! The chemistry teacher? Uh-huh. I don't know what it is about that guy, but every time I get a look at his bald head and manic eyes, I go all gooey inside. <laughs> okay, that's enough information. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Love is blind. I sure hope so. Hey, kid, I need you to do me a favor. Dr. Watts doesn't actually realize that we're going on a date yet. <laughs> but we are. <laughs> and I need to get ready. So, can you get me Ms. Phillips' perfume from the staff room? You know where that is, right? Oh, and I almost forgot. Some candy and some sedatives. And for the sedatives, don't buy them. Just look for them in the trash. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I can do that. Good. <sighs> Gorgeous. I'm sure of it. All the signs are there. Well, buckle up at my fault. Fire alarm. Fire! Please do not pull the fire alarm. You really should know better. Sweet. What do you think of me? Hey, Edna, I got your stuff. Hey, Edna, you old bat, I got your stuff. Ha! Oh, whoa. How do I look? <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> if I was 50 years older, I'd date you myself. Ah, thanks, kid. Ha! Where's the perfume? Right here. Ah, <clears throat> oh, thanks. I needed that. 
I get so nervous before a date. Yeah, well, good luck, Edna. Hey, kid, wait! I need you to do me a favor. Another one? Yeah. What's in it for me? Ha! I won't spit in your food. Will you spit in Mr. Hattricks if I say yes? <laughs> for you, kid, I'll do worse than spit. Okay. <laughs> what do you want? I want to go on a nice date with Dr. Watt. So go then. Have fun. Yeah. Well, you know what you kids are like. You see a beautiful couple out on a date, and you're bound to do anything to ruin it. You got a point. So listen, I need you to watch out for me and keep those disgusting kids away. I should teach lessons or something. Let's do my this. corrupt colleague. Is this what you're looking for? That a boy. Ah, you skipped school, I do! What's the point? Huh? 
on me, Pete. No, you cheat! Sorry, man. You're in the wrong part of town, Richard. Pay attention.
poop here. Go, go, poop? go! Well, it certainly uh, is no, nothing easy. like this your is. cooking. <laughs> I know! I've spent many years slaving away to get this good. It didn't come easy, I'll tell you that. You know, Edna, I was quite surprised when you asked me to have coffee lots. with you. Are Look, you, like, <laughs> coming up with biological experiments for the school? I never knew food? you were interested in chemistry. Oh, my dear doctor, I am very passionate in my love of chemistry. It's all I can think about when I'm cooking away in my kitchen. It seems a student has been leaving muffins in my classroom Edna, when I'm not really? there. But they're just awful. I mean, I really I bad. Someone. I wonder who it that could be. That's nice about the four. Awful, you say? Why, you, uh, I mean, I, I don't know who it could be. <laughs> Damn noisy, please. so silly. I hate most of them. You know, I'm just little brat. Ah, the foolish infatuations of you. you really do smash it. I suppose my you mastery of the in fascinating here. subject of chemistry could quite affect a young woman. Oh, yes, me too. I imagine yeah, you you're a scientist. About your you should be able to help us eat right. Right? Why are you wasting your time with that wind? Hey, Edna. Side. You know, I really love the food um, you cook. Yeah, uh, sounds like you've, uh, given it some thought. Oh, yes. I mean, no, I mean, it's obvious, isn't it? Your coffee is getting cold. What? me. Drink it all. It's good stuff. Yo, yeah, you're a scientist. A little, you I... should be able to help us eat right. It must be the fumes from the lab. Yeah, that's probably it. Have some more coffee. I'm feeling not good. Oh, I better go. show you what I know about chemistry <laughs> and a little biology <laughs> mm. my work here is done Evening, sir. Yo, boy! What do you think you're doing? Nothing. What about you? Well, I'm, uh, uh, I, I'm looking for naughty boys. I, I mean, I'm looking for naughty boys in the wrong parts of town. Uh, uh, what I mean, Hopkins, is that I'm glad to report that in that disgusting store, I did not find one naughty boy. Not one. Well, that's good, sir, because filth like that can really rot a young man's mind. Exactly! That's why I got this research. 
to check on the dangers. It's good to see a teacher so dedicated to his work, sir. Thank you! No problem. But I'll tell you, Hopkins, I'm quite worn out with all this work. I don't uh, suppose you could do me a favor. What? Well, uh, how do I put this? I'm in charge of the laundry this week, but I got so carried away with my research that I forgot to collect it all at the same time. <laughs> it would be embarrassing to ask for it now. Oh, uh, maybe you could help, but you'll uh, have to be discreet. Discretion is my middle name, sir. Great! So go and collect all the dirty laundry from the, uh, girls' dorm. Okay. And if you get caught, I know nothing about it. I won't say anything, sir. In fact, I'll make it clear that I never saw you coming out of an adult store clutching illicit magazines. Good boy! Now hurry up and bring them to me by the school gates, but... Shh. I'll see you soon, Jimmy. Pretend you don't know it's curfew. Get going! I'm just going to collect this. I'll take that. I was just looking for one of those. You are in a world of trouble, young man. You pervert! Get out of the girl's dorm!
This might be useful. Everybody, calm down. We're big one. I appear. There is nothing here. What's he doing here? Is this a football team? I hope these are worth all the trouble I just went through. Yes, thanks for this laundry. Here's some money for your troubles. And that's that. I'm out to play. I swear I saw something. What's that I saw moving about?